Hello, hello, and hello. My name is Tino Trevor. Welcome to the English Experience, the place to learn clear, simple, and practical English you can use in the real world. I'm in Sao Paulo for the next three days. I'm actually here for a teacher's conference, but while I'm here, I might as well enjoy the sights. As you can see, I needed to find a quiet place to film. It was loud down there thanks to all the block parties going on at the moment. In today's lesson, we'll cover some essential carnival vocabulary. Let's get started. Carnival, or carnaval, as the Brazilians call it, is the biggest party on the planet and it takes place mainly in Rio de Janeiro, Sao Paulo, and Bahia, Brazil. I've been lucky enough to experience the biggest party on the planet not once but twice. The first time in Rio and the second time right here in Sao Paulo. During carnival you'll find a lot of partiers on the streets. You can't miss them in their elaborate costumes or lack thereof. Some of the partiers choose to wear masks and some don't. It's a party goer's choice. One of the best ways to enjoy carnival is to attend a block party. Block parties happen all over the place. There are small block parties and there are huge block parties. It's all up to you which one you want to join in and enjoy. The block parties are characterized by having a band or a famous musician playing from the top of a moving truck. Almost every block party has a theme. It's not just people randomly dancing and choosing costumes. The costumes are carefully chosen to match the chosen theme. Competition is a big part of Carnival. The parades that you see are actually different samba schools in competition with one another, vying for a million dollar prize. In front, in the middle, or behind each parade, you'll often find floats. The floats clearly demonstrate the chosen theme of each samba school. Balls. No, it's not what you think. In Brazil, there are three different ways to celebrate Carnival. The parades, block parties, and balls. Balls are elaborate parties that are characterized by the playing of funk music, a lot of debauchery, half-naked people enjoying Carnival in the streets. They are also locally known as bailis. You can't speak of Carnival without mentioning Samba. Samba is the main music and dance of Carnival. However, you will also hear other genres of music including rock, MPB, satanejo, and funk. Carnival is also characterized by dancing in the streets. Most dances are actually led by dancing queens. Of course, whenever you have crowds and lots of people in the streets, you also need law and order. So around every block, around every corner, amidst every crowd, you'll often find police. The police are mainly there just to make their presence known so as to deter any illicit or criminal activity. Carnival celebrations, block parties and balls normally start from early in the morning until late in the day. As such, people are drinking all day and are usually drunk by the end of it. You'll find inebriated party goers everywhere you go. Whether you're into big parties, crowds or not, Carnival, or Carnaval as the Brazilians call it, is something you need to experience at least once in your lifetime. To recap, our words are Carnival, Partiers, Costume, Mask, Block Party, Band, Musician, Theme, Competition, Parade, Float, Balls, Music, Dancing, Carnival Queen, police, and drug. I hope you found that useful. I'm Tino Trevor. Thanks for watching. Cheers. Peace out.